After a dramatic airport standoff on Tuesday and nearly a week of back and forth legal maneuverings, the question of will she leave the country or won't she has been answered. She can't. Former Philippine President Gloria Arroyo is now officially under arrest and facing charges of electoral sabotage in the 2007 local polls. The case was filed on Friday in a lower Manila court by election commissioners working with the Justice Department. This was just hours before Arroyo planned to leave the country again for medical reasons. This is part of uh, the uh, worst political persecution that's being done against the former president because they have uh, uh, filed this uh, case uh, in a wrong court. The court that uh, had uh, issued the warrant doesn't have jurisdiction over this case. But the Arroyos say it is personal and the government has perverted justice. They're questioning the arrest order and say the lower court isn't even the proper venue for cases against government officials. Arroyo was president of the Philippines for nearly a decade and faced numerous allegations of corruption while she was in power. She was widely unpopular and the current president made it a campaign promise to hold her accountable for any wrongdoings. But many Filipinos question why it took more than a year to even begin legal proceedings against Arroyo. Arroyo will remain in police custody in hospital until her doctors say she is well enough to be moved. For now, her lawyers say they will cooperate with the government, but insist that the battle is far from over. Margot Ortigas, Al Jazeera, Manila.